The city tournament is set to begin next week, but the nine city CS8 schools are already starting their own tournament. At the Bowl in Jacksonville, MacArthur taking on Glenwood. Second quarter, Kevonte Johnson takes it to the rack, and generals are down by one. Then, Cole Harper goes in strong, overshoots it, but Joe Alexander gets the lucky hand in. He saved the ball. Titans continue. Ethan Hunt uses some moves, gets the bucket. And Glenwood's up 15 to 10. Late second quarter, QR Curran to Dallas McLean. He's good for three, but Glenwood, your victor, 61 to 48. And Gavin Block with the steal, and he takes it all the way to the house. Aaron Hop rebounds and makes the second chance points. You gotta love the video, son. Later on in the first, Peyton Ebler sends the bullet to Aaron Hop. He gets the two. Then Eisenhower trying to get something going. Caleb Taylor takes it in and secures the jumper for the team's first bucket. Then Hop fakes the shot, gets to Gavin Block, and he gets the basket. And like I said earlier, Lincoln wins 53-20. to The Cyclones in Canon Conference play. They host Champaign Centennial. Second quarter from the corner, Kyrie Sago drains the three. And game tied at 22. SHG answers, Alex Mandeville. He makes his own three. Well done. Watch, Stephen Lee. He fights his way in. Gets the points. The game is tied up this time at 27. Then Sean McDonald feeds it to Gabe Green, who takes it to the rack. But that's followed right up by Anthony Martin. Watch him at the left side of your screen. He sinks the three ball right at the half buzzer. Centennial takes it by two, 67 to 65. The Sangamon County Tournament wraps up this evening with its championship game. Rochester taking on Auburn. The Rockets looking for its first tournament title in more than 15 years. Third quarter, Dalton Hanlon is blocked. Check out Connor Barola. He got it, but he got it to Drew Points. That feeds it to Everett Stevens. Overall, great play. And Trojans trail of 39-23. Hanlon tries a three. Nope. Colin Stallworth grabs the rebound, gets the points. Then late in the third quarter, Stallworth collects the rebound. Gets it all the way over to Howard Fisher. Watch him make the three ball right at the buzzer to end the third quarter. Rochester wins 55-35. to They win their first Sangamon County tournament title since 1998. Over in the Winchester tournament, Porta AC taking on Carrollton in the championship game. Third quarter, Luke Gillingham grabs the rebound. And launches it deep, as you saw Jacob Smith made the two. And later, it's Smith returning the favor. Gillingham makes the three ball this time. The Blue Jays would get the response. Matt Mueller from the outside drained the three. It's 35-32. Then Mitch Mueller gets it over to his brother. And the jumper is good to go. Porta AC wins the 93rd Winchester Tournament, 52-49.